Welcome to your inspiration quick travel guide. In this series, we delve deep into a wealth of information from various sites and video content to bring you the best travel insights. Today, we embark on an enchanting journey to the heart of Western Europe, to a land where the sun kisses the sea and history intertwines with modernity, Portugal. From the sun-drenched beaches of the Algarve to the historic charm of Évora, the vibrant city of Porto to the picturesque islands of Madeira, we'll explore the diverse landscapes, rich culture, and mouth-watering cuisine that make Portugal a must-visit destination. So sit back, relax, and let us guide you through the captivating sights, sounds, and tastes of this remarkable country. Our journey begins in the charming city of Faro. Kicking off our journey is the captivating city of Faro, a gem in the heart of the Algarve region. Faro, with its charm, is a city that captures your heart in an instant. Picture this, narrow cobblestone streets that wind their way through a well-preserved old town, each turn revealing another piece of Faro's rich history. The old town, a testament to the city's resilience, is a step back in time, with architectural marvels that have withstood the test of time. But Faro isn't all about the past. It's a city that thrives in the present while cherishing its history. Just a stone's throw away, you'll find the stunning Ria Formosa Lagoon, a natural paradise that is a haven for birdwatchers and nature enthusiasts alike. The lagoon's tranquil waters mirror the sky, creating a picture-perfect vista. Faro, where the sun kisses the sea, is an ideal starting point for any Portuguese adventure. This charming city sets the tone for the enchanting journey that lies ahead in Portugal. Next up is Sintra, a town that feels plucked straight from a fairy tale. A UNESCO World Heritage Site, Sintra is a captivating blend of natural beauty and architectural wonder. At the heart of this enchantment lies the Peña Palace. With a medley of colors and architectural styles, it's like stepping into a fantastical storybook. Now let's descend into the mystical depths of Quinta da Regalera. This Gothic mansion is a labyrinth of hidden tunnels and caves shrouded in mystery and allure. Its enchanting gardens filled with symbolic references to alchemy, masonry, the Knights Templar, and the Rosicrucians will leave you utterly intrigued. And don't forget the town itself with its lush gardens offering a cool respite from the Portuguese sun. Wander through the leafy paths under the shade of towering ferns and palms and you'll find yourself lost in a verdant paradise. Sintra, a place where every corner is a postcard, is a must-visit for every romantic at heart. Moving on, we arrive at Evora, an open-air museum of history and culture. Let's take a moment to dive into the charm of this UNESCO World Heritage Site. Evora holds a treasure trove of centuries-old architectural marvels from Roman ruins to Gothic wonders. The Roman temple, often referred to as the Temple of Diana, stands as a proud testament to the city's ancient roots. Its Corinthian columns tower over the city, whispering tales of a time when the Roman Empire held sway. Our journey continues to the imposing Evora Cathedral, a majestic Gothic masterpiece. It's no ordinary cathedral, it's a symbol of spiritual strength and resilience, with its lofty towers and intricate carvings reflecting the city's deep-rooted faith. Evora is more than just a city, it's a time capsule. Every cobblestone street, every weathered facade narrates a tale from a bygone era, inviting you to step back in time and experience the rich tapestry of Portugal's history. Evora, where the past meets the present, is a testament to Portugal's vibrant history. Next, we explore Porto, a city that's as lively as it is picturesque. Known for its medieval Ribera district with its narrow cobbled streets and ancient houses, Porto is a city that wears its history with pride. Its vibrancy is reflected not just in its colorful buildings, but also in its bustling markets and energetic nightlife. The city is nestled along the Douro River, which adds a unique charm to its landscape. The river is not just a beautiful sight to behold, but also an integral part of the city's culture and history. And no discussion of Porto would be complete without mentioning its world-famous port wine. This sweet red wine is a testament to the city's rich winemaking tradition and is savored by connoisseurs worldwide. Whether you're a wine enthusiast or not, a trip to Porto isn't complete without a taste of this iconic beverage. Porto, 
with its timeless charm and vibrant energy, is a city that'll steal your heart. We now set sail for Madeira, an island paradise unlike any other. Imagine a land of endless green, where exotic flowers bloom in a riot of colors, and the air carries the sweet scent of the sea. This, dear travelers, is Madeira, a volcanic island in the middle of the Atlantic. It's a place where nature has been allowed to run wild, creating a landscape of breathtaking beauty. But it's not just the scenery that makes Madeira so special. This island is home to a unique variety of flora and fauna, some of which can't be found anywhere else in the world. Stroll through the lush laurel forests, a UNESCO World Heritage Site, and you'll feel like you've stepped into a fairy tale. And then there's the wine. Madeira's namesake, wine is rich, complex, and absolutely delicious. It's the perfect accompaniment to a day of exploring this island paradise. Madeira, a paradise in the Atlantic, is a haven for nature lovers and wine enthusiasts alike. Hope you're enjoying our journey through Portugal. We've explored the picturesque Madeira, and soon we'll be basking in the beauty of the Algarve. But the adventure doesn't stop there. We have so much more in store for you, from the enchanting Douro Valley to the historic charm of Lisbon. So buckle up because we're just getting started. If you're enjoying this journey as much as we are, don't forget to support us by hitting that like button and subscribing to our channel. Your support helps us bring more exciting destinations to your screens. Stay tuned for more amazing destinations. Your support means the world to us. Back on the mainland, we head to the Algarve, Portugal's southernmost region. Known for its breathtaking coastline, the Algarve is a paradise of golden beaches where the sand sparkles under the radiant sun. The turquoise waters of the Atlantic beckon, inviting you to take a dip, or perhaps try your hand at some water sports. The Algarve isn't just about beaches, though. Step into the charming seaside towns that dot the coastline, each one a treasure trove of history and culture. Wander through quaint, narrow streets past whitewashed houses with vibrantly colored trim. Enjoy a meal of fresh seafood at a local taverna and feel the warmth of the Algarvian people. Whether you're a thrill seeker, looking for adventure, or someone seeking tranquility and relaxation, the Algarve has something for everyone. The Algarve, where summer never ends, is the perfect destination for beach bums and sun worshippers. Next, we venture into the Douro Valley, a region that's as enchanting as it is fertile. This magical land is a tapestry of terraced vineyards, creating a stunning quilt of greens and golds that stretch as far as the eye can see. Every twist and turn of the valley is a testament to human ingenuity, a symphony of the earth and man working in harmony. Now picture yourself sailing down the Douro River, a serene journey that carves its way through the heart of the valley. Imagine the gentle lull of the water, the warm sun on your face, and the thrill of discovery around each bend. And then there's the valley's crowning glory, its world-renowned port wines. Each glass is a celebration of the Douro's rich soils and centuries-old winemaking traditions. The taste, smooth, complex, and utterly unforgettable. The Douro Valley, with its rolling hills and tranquil river, is a treat for the senses. We now journey to the Azores, a group of islands that are as majestic as they are remote. Rising from the depths of the Atlantic Ocean, the Azores are a testament to the raw power of nature. The island's landscapes are a dramatic spectacle of volcanic craters, steaming fumaroles, and verdant pastures that stretch as far as the eye can see. But it's not just the landscapes that are captivating. The Azores harbor a rich biodiversity, providing a home for a myriad of species, from the endemic Azorean bullfinch to the majestic sperm whales that roam the surrounding waters. Yet the Azores are more than just their landscapes and wildlife. They are home to a unique culture that has for centuries been shaped by the sea and the isolation of island life. From the charming cobblestone streets of Ponta Delgada to the vibrant festivals that celebrate the island's rich heritage, the Azores offer a distinct and enriching experience. The Azores, where the land meets the sea, is a destination for the adventurous and the curious. We return to the mainland for our penultimate destination, Lisbon, the captivating capital. The city is a treasure trove of historic neighborhoods, each with its own distinct personality. The Alfama district, for instance, is a maze of narrow winding streets that whisper tales of the past, while the trendy Barro Alto is the heart of the city's vibrant nightlife. 
Moving around Lisbon, you can't miss the iconic yellow trams. These vintage vehicles meander through the city's steep and narrow streets, offering a unique and charming mode of transport. And let's not forget about the delicious pastel de nada. These creamy custard tarts with their flaky crust and dusting of cinnamon are a local favorite and a must try for any food lover. Lisbon, a city that's as diverse as it is captivating, is a melting pot of cultures and experiences. It's a place where the old coexists with the new, creating a rich tapestry that's truly bewitching. Finally, we arrive at our top destination, Coimbra, the crown jewel of Portugal. This city is a blend of the old and the new, where ancient traditions meet the vibrancy of student life. Coimbra is home to one of the oldest universities in the world, University of Coimbra. This prestigious institution has been shaping minds for over seven centuries and is a UNESCO World Heritage Site. Its stunning architecture and rich history are a testament to the city's intellectual legacy. But there's more to Coimbra than just academia. The city's historic old town is a treasure trove of, of medieval architecture, winding alleyways and quaint cafes. It's a place where you can lose yourself in the past while enjoying a cup of Portuguese coffee. The city's vibrant student life brings a youthful energy that contrasts beautifully with its historic charm. From lively fado music performances to buzzing bars, Coimbra is a city that never sleeps. Coimbra, where tradition meets innovation, is a city that embodies the spirit of Portugal. As our journey through the stunning vistas and charming cities of Portugal comes to a close, we hope you've been inspired by the rich history, vibrant culture, and breathtaking landscapes that make Portugal a gem of Europe. But don't forget, travel enthusiasts, this is just the beginning. There are countless other destinations waiting for your exploration. And to ensure you don't miss out on any of our future adventures, we invite you to like this video and subscribe to our channel. By doing so, you're supporting us in creating more content to fuel your wanderlust. Don't forget to hit the bell icon to receive notifications every time we post a new video. In the description below, you'll find essential links and resources for your travel and ticketing needs. These are here to help you plan your own unforgettable journey. Remember, every journey begins with a single step. So take that step today. Until our next adventure, happy traveling.